One year ago, uh, there was this crazy idea, shall we make Youth for Climate forever? It's such a wonderful opportunity to see many of you again since we met in Milan. Welcome back. It's good to see you again. Last year, we asked the organizers like, what are we going to do next? We don't want to keep talking on events and we want something that is more sustainable, that is long term. And that is what is happening this year. Powering Action is all about what are we doing? What is youth doing? How can we actually support, interact, engage, elevate the concrete initiatives, projects, organizations that all of us are doing on the ground? Powering Action is really the perfect summary of what we need for the next step of the youth climate movement. We have to create proper conditions for youth to organize proposals, but also that it's very important to bring these proposals to the proper international tables. Now, we have drafted the manifesto last year, but this year the event means how can we take all of these words into action? And for me, that is getting ideas from a lot of friends, sharing what I've been up to, and the most important thing, building coalitions between each other. Having the opportunity to engage with all of my fellow delegates from around the world, hear their stories, hear their solutions, and see where the commonalities may lie. I'm here to check the ideas that would be helpful back to the grassroots communities. That is what powering action means to me. It's not talking, it's walking the walk. You are the ones who are going to drive this train and here we are sitting to listen to you, to be guided by you and hopefully to form an alliance with you that will change the future of the world. You have to create a legacy. You have to create a story, a story of proposals, a story of attacking, a story of truth. You are the witnesses of the future. You are going to tell our successors whether we are keeping our word. As we move from New York to Sharm el Sheikh, it's about moving from pledges into implementation. We want to take what's happening in Youth for Climate and ensure young people's voices are heard, their engagement is advanced up until COP28. Let's do it, let's implement it, let's take action into reality. Leaders, you need us because we see hope where you may see defeat, where you may see difficulty of phasing out fossil fuels. We see the opportunity for innovation and justice. Join us. We are powering action. We are powering action. We, we, we are powering action. Action, action. We are powering action. Youth are powering action. action.